Curved TVs were the biggest buzz of the 2014 Consumer Electronics Show. Everybody had one to show off. Samsung even had one that could bend from flat to curved at the press of a button. But that doesn't mean you should buy one. I'm Donald Bell, and in this top five, I'm counting down the reasons to think twice before buying one of these curved TVs. Starting things off at number five, they stick out. I mean, they literally stick out. Just when we finally got some affordable and possibly thin TVs that can blend right into your wall, now all of a sudden we're supposed to be cool with TVs that have wings. It's creepy. It's like the TV's coming in for a hug. I need boundaries. At number four, size. Because these things visually distort at the edges, you'll either need to go really big or sit really close for it to seem immersive and not annoying. Now there's a reason that all of the curved TVs of CES were around 80 to 100 inches, because anything smaller, and it's just kind of a novelty. Coming in at number three, positioning. Now with the curved screen, the visual sweet spot gets pretty narrow. Anything less than front and center, and those wings start directing the image away from you. Now for one or two people, it's immersive, but family movie night is gonna have some cheap seats. At number two, price. If you think the hot new trend in TVs will be cheap, think again. Especially when you figure you're gonna need to buy something over 70 inches just to do it right. If you can find an affordable curved TV in 2014, it's probably just a flat panel someone left in the sun too long. Now before we get to the number one reason not to buy a curved TV, let me take a moment to point out some reasons why you may want to buy one anyway. Without a doubt, these TVs are going to be fun to show off. They're great for gamers who are gonna be sitting up close to the TV anyway. A version with a 21.9 screen could be cool for you pure movie experience fanatics. And arguably, these screens minimize ambient lighting reflections, but ultimately, the main reason you should buy a curved TV is that you have too much money on your hands and you just need to throw it around and buy <laughs> All right, and now, the number one reason not to buy a curved TV, it's a fad. This is the perfect example of manufacturers doing something just because they can, not because it actually makes sense. If they can convince everyone that flat screens are out of fashion, they stand to make a lot of money. But in five years, when flat is back, that curved screen on your wall is gonna look about as cool as a pair of acid wash mom jeans. So there you go, five reasons to keep your flat screen flat. Now for a more in-depth reasoning of the appeal and drawbacks of curved screens, check out David Kassmeyer's post on CNET titled, are curved TVs a gimmick? And of course, for more top fives from me, go to top5.cnet.com. I'm Donald Bell. Thanks for watching.